Hello there, my name is Sam and thank you so so much for coming to this channel. Now in this video I'm going to show you a few mappings that I used in order to make the scratches that you saw in the beginning of this video possible. Now this is something that I really sat down and figured out on my own and of course this thing really came through. And maybe I'm going to spend a few seconds or minutes trying to explain these so that you really get the concepts and then apply them in your mixes. But before we get started, if you are new to my channel, please at least subscribe to keep us going. And of course, if you are really my subscriber, I love you so much. Let's get started straight away. See you there. Alright, so here we go. Now, the fact here is I really had to use the old skin of Virtual DJ to make the settings work. Now, I just went to my settings and of course changed the theme to old. Okay, then after doing that, cancel and then go back. Now, I already have these hot cues set, but I want to first clear everything and then start afresh for you to really get this. I see I have some also on deck too, although we are not going to use the deck, but we can also clear that. Just that, okay. Now, on deck two, I have this instrument of, of kilometer by Banner Boy. I split it somewhere. I'll show you that in another video on how to split. Then on the first deck, I have the real song itself. And I always I have these pads on hot cues too. If you don't have it loaded, please come to the box and that, that drop down menu and then select hot cues. Make sure it's under hot cues. Now you're good to go to the mappings, go to the settings, that configuration, head to the mappings section. Well, now in the key area here, you're going to be using the keys that you want. Okay, for example, I'm going to be using F1. To set the first hot cue for the first pad as I play the music you get as I'm playing the music and I press F1 along I'll be setting the first cue in fact how to use hot cues maybe I'll have to talk about that in details in another video okay now F2 F3 4 you'll be writing down pad 1 pad 2 and pad 3 and pad 4 in the action box correspondingly and then I use this 1 2 3 4 keys on my keyboard for example the first key is saying pad one and stop and cue all right so here it means if i press the first key i'm going to be able to trigger pad one as i have set before the first hot cue and then stop it okay it won't play anymore and then i'll be using it to cue these are three actions in one that is pad one okay it goes to the first cue and doesn't keep playing the music the music stops and then you'll be cueing as you scratch Get the concepts right you'll try it for yourself after setting this right in your mappings all right so the same thing for part two it goes to the hot q2 you'll be queuing you'll be scratching part three is the same thing just just copy that and paste and then part four you can do it up to even part eight if you really want so that's what i really did basically that's the most important part okay check that out really it's correct do the spacing and do everything right and then of course it is going to work then i used z to go to the first beat in case i just loaded the music this is going to be for people who want to be advanced i used x for selecting the active deck i didn't use it in the mix as you had but i know you're going to explore and it's going to help you during your practices and then i used c for q and play so if i press c and then hold for a second or two the music continues playing i didn't use it too but you can use it later I used this scratch forward I mean scratch backward I used V I, I had to set it down I, as you can see in the action here scratch minus 120 ms yeah so then B was for a single key scratch of course I was using it alongside the scratch forward and scratch backward you already know how to set this if you don't know it is right here this is the mapping down in the box or you can you can refer to my previous videos and then I used N to scratch forward okay to scratch ahead by 120 milliseconds okay if you also don't know that i have a video on that already you can check i used the space bar here to play and stutter if you don't know how i have it also in previous videos but you'll also try this in case you said it right you try and see what the space bar does you can also use it aside others 
in case you want to be doing the practice extensively although i didn't use it while playing this music in the beginning it's going to help you later i know you're going to be really practicing now that is what i have so you can save your mapping and then cancel you go back okay that's what i did after setting all my things i saved and went back now to make it a little bit creative i had to leave this theme because some people don't love the skin <laughs> so i had to come back to this the interface and then change to default this is going to make it very hard for someone to understand how you really set it because in this default skin or any other skin you can't see where to start to set these hot cues whatsoever they're somehow hidden unless you just want to explore so this is all set you can go ahead and start playing your music i didn't show you how but practice okay so thank you for watching i hope the video really worked out for you if you liked it please give me a thumbs up if there's anything i should know please comment and if you are new please subscribe see you in the next one